of the most funny thing that I have come across within the last 48 hours is the fact that the Nigerian army is responding to Asaru the Kumba. Remember that I brought to you in one of our video last, which you can see here, where Asaru is, was talking about the, you know, helicopter flying over his house. And according to him, he said he had the capability to bring it down. And I rightfully said, if somebody can make such statement in Nigeria or in a nation, then the person is a security threat to the country. But the army is saying that... By some individual that they can shoot down the helicopter of the military, I think that's laughable. In fact, I'm about to laugh about that. And I say that because... You know, we're in a democracy and, we're in a and we are a professional force. We cannot just based on somebody's comments begin to do certain things and then they will now accuse the military of being undemocratic. The military is not the only security agency, force or department in the country. There are other security forces who have a role to play constitutionally when it comes to some of these issues. But I tell you that he doesn't have that capability. He's just blabbing. But I will allow the security forces that are responsible for handling such cases to take up the matter. Ours is come on the battlefield and we take you out. You should come on the battlefield and see whether we can react or not. Yes, I understand very well the position of the Nigerian army. Kudos to the uh, Brigadier General, who, you know, what he said is really, really, it really, really makes sense because, you know, when they go into that, their operation, whatever, at the end of the day, you know, we will normally come to talk, where are the civil rights and all of that. But the truth of the matter still remains, that the Nigerian police were the subject of the matter in this conversation, when Asuri Dukumbo released that video, which you watched earlier. But the truth is that he called for questioning. How, what did you have that you can bring down, uh, you know, a jet, a police jet or a military, you know, jet? Really? If you are a former militant, I think you have handed over your weapon and all of that to the government. What are you still keeping? These are the conversations that the Nigerian security, especially the Nigerian police, needed to do that investigation and call for questioning. If I make such statement... Today, and I said that the president of Nigeria, or maybe I said that any jet that fly over my house, I will bring it down. All of you know already that this channel, <laughs> you'll be hearing that I've been uh, picked by the DSS or the SSS and the rest. That's the honest truth. But this is Asaru the Kumbo. Until now, I've not seen any invitation sent to him. Neither have I seen any form of arrest. And this is not to uh, a call for his arrest anyway. Everybody is entitled to his opinion, but there are some certain statements exactly saying that he's going to bring down, you know, the jet that it was threatening him and all of that. However, now he never reached that level, Oga. What do you make of this from the point of the military and that of Asaru Dokumbo? Is Nigeria turning into a banana republic? <laughs> Let me have you take a conversation. Thank you for watching.